Now at five, breaking news, Iran attacks Israel, launching dozens of drones and ballistic missiles in an unprecedented revenge mission. Good evening, everybody. Thank you for joining us at five here. I'm Tom Wayne. And I'm Leslie Manin. Let's get right to KCAL News. Joy Benedict in our newsroom with more on the attack now pushing the Middle East closer to a regional war, Joy. I mean, yeah, this is really hard for so many people. It's been something that has been discussed for several days now, Leslie and Tom, but this attack is expected to unfold over the next several hours. And within the last hour, air raid sirens, as you heard, started going off in Jerusalem and explosions were heard in the skies above. Israel says it is ready for the attack with missile defense systems on the ground and fighter jets in the air. But CBS News is also reporting that so far at least one one casualty in this attack, marking the first time that Iran has ever launched a direct military assault on Israel. Until the point of birth, the former president has said recently he supports letting states handle the issue, but he has not been clear about what restrictions he approves of. Thanks so much for watching. Breaking news, Iran strikes back at Israel.